done, witch. Now to clear out Ruid's men and light that brazier. Best not to draw attention here. the last of them. Once the brazier is lit, the rest of Ruth's men should arrive. Odin gives me a bargain. A few dead men at my feet in exchange for a ripe East Anglia, and my wife returned. What a day! 
You. I don't know you. I am Eivor of the Raven Clan. The clan your men attacked before I fed them to the crows. <laughs> Who called for me? Was it you, Valdis, my love? Why would I call you now? After five happy years away from your stinking balls. I called you, Ruit. You, Oswald, the hopeful king of East Anglia. And Valdis' husband-to-be. Take your men and go. East Anglia is strong with Saxons and Danes united. It will not fall to raiders. Must I set sail for Denmark with nothing to show for the journey, after coming all this way? You'll have my weight in silver. And an abundance of livestock and grain. I've taken ten times that already. What's the real prize? I'll make you an offer, Pigfoot. A home gang, just you and me, for the future of your kingdom. I accept. I accept. A fight to the death. East Anglia's the prize. Let it be heard. Hey, what? The hazel is laid! The square is made. When you see a chance, lead Valdus and the brothers to safety. They must not fight today. East Anglia needs them. Let me be your champion. No. He called on me. Whenever you're ready, King of Sheep Set. I'm ready! They're breaking off. They've given up for now. Let's put some distance between us. We can rest a moment. I saw he fought well. Raging like a bonfire. We should go back! Oswald may have survived. Ruid as well. It's possible. Ruid's men will press their advantage. We must be ready when they attack. We'll go to Norwich. Meet me there when you can. He died a hero. There's no doubt. If his god won't take him, all the sword women will.
Elmenham will not recover. None of us will. Another king lost, Abel. Stop washing your face with mead. How can I face half Don Jarl now? I've failed him again. We can take the battle to what remains of Ruit's clan before they hit back. Easier said than done. His men are holed up in Borg Castle, a fortress on the sea. On the sea? Then it must have a harbor. It does. Guarded by a gate of hefty iron held in place by timber spikes, difficult to force open. Timber burns. It does, but how do we reach it? We rig your ship with oil at her front, sail it ablaze at the gate. They would see us coming, long before we reached the walls. We raise a fiat, an army of East Anglia's farmers, throw them at the front gate as a distraction. <laughs> Saxons willing to die for a bunch of Danes? It's a stretch. It can work, Finir. If they fight in Oswald's name, that is all the courage they will need. <laughs> you there? Did you hear of Thane Oswald's fate? Aye, we did. He dragged Ruid to the bowels of Elba, Dane devil. Ruid may be gone, but his clan still plagues East Anglia. And would you join us to rid your kingdom of his dogs? For Oswald? Aye, anything. Two eager Saxons is not yet defeated. But you may be right. We may have a chance. I can ride to Elmenham and muster what remains of Oswald's men there. But who else would join us? The Reeve of Thaedford, Winston. He's a bitter old barnacle, but he would fight to the death for this land. We can assemble a forward camp at the ruins north of Boer Castle. Ride with me, Finir. Let's pay this Reeve a visit. With any hope? The Uvort remains untouched by Ruid's violence. Hope is a scarce word in this kingdom. Maybe so, but I would rather hold on to something, anything, than ride with empty hands. If Ruid's clan continues to roam this kingdom unchecked, the people of East Anglia will be as ravaged as these lands. And where do we find ourselves? Riding into the fence to beg a horde of frightened farmers for aid. To fight for a king that you gave them, Finir. Remember that. It was my task to find them a king, not protect that king against every danger that might befall him. Oswald wasn't crowned yet, nor was he married. I say you have some work yet to do. Right, right. No need to remind me how far I fell short. Watch your back. Wood's clan may still be nearby. <laughs> what did you expect, brother? Sword and silver? 
Payroll, just ahead. Wood smoke and ash. Ruitsmen have been here. No time to waste what the Lord has given us. He was one. Everything is gone, Ray. Everything. Ah, uh, my friend, we will rebuild, I promise you. I ain't got the strength, no. You have a will of iron coming here, knowing your kind did all this. Ruit's clan is your enemy, not me. I come on behalf of the late Oswald of Elmenham. You're still a Dane from top to two. It's your meddling that led to Oswald's death, leaving our kingdom for the worse. Oswald was a friend and ally, Reeve. He fought beside me, and I by him. And look where that got him. East Anglia will fall if Ruid's clan is not defeated. Fight with me to drive them off. For Oswald and your kinsmen. Pretty words, Dane. But the men of Theovard have their own battles to fight. If you need an axe, I'm standing right here. There's a village to the east, Kingsbury. It was taken by Ruid's men a fortnight ago. And I'll not rest until it's back in our hands. Let me and my raiders take the village. Save your strength and join us for the fight to come. Bold offer. If you do as you promise, the pikes at Theavard will be yours. I will take this news to our forward camp, Abel. Follow where you can. I will see you there. Kingsbury's church has a great horror on atop its steeple. If you manage the task, blew it. But I'll know you kept your word. I ain't got the strength no more. Stand tall. You there. Dane. A word, if you will. This place is heavily guarded. Kingsbury. Infested with Ruid's men.
out!
your victory. The Reeve has come to join me. Let's hope his promise holds. The horn! It's been too long since I've heard that sweet sound! Grace me! Are you dying? Over here! I held to my oath, Reeve. I hope you will honor yours. My promise holds, I. The Ord will join you in the fight against Ruid's clan. With your aid, we may yet save East Anglia. In past times, that horn was used to muster fears all across our land. You may find others who have warmed to its call. Good. Whatever willing men you find, rally them soon at the ruins north of Burr Castle. Theobard has answered the call. I should join Finir at our forward camp.
horn came from Elmenham. Valdis must have got to them. The brothers' fleet, gathered and ready. <laughs> Can we really do oh, this? That. We're just Final. Lucky, I should have my my ship to use again. I was tired of gathering dust. Our ships are stirred. Eivor! Word of your actions in Thaevord has spread like wildfire. Men are pouring in from across East Anglia, and our ships stand ready. Thaedward's Reeve is with us. His men will be here soon. More than his, the Kingsbury Horn has inspired men all across this kingdom. We will have the army we need. It seems Oswald got what he wanted in the end. Saxon and Dane united in common cause. A pity he's not here to see it. The forces will be ready soon. Are you ready to start the assault? I am. Our target is Burg Castle, said to be impenetrable. Good. Let them have their false confidence. By cover of night, Baldus will lead the field at the front gates. With Ruid's men distracted, our forces move on the sea gate from the backwaters at their backs. And once we're in, we'll leave no gate closed in that castle. Ruid's men cannot be allowed to dig in further. Your longship, is she ready? She awaits her own special glory. They need your words, Eivor. For a long time you lived in fear. Your house is razed, your fields scorched. Now your chance has come. Fight to be free of this pain. Fight to be free of fear. Freedom! Freedom! Now is the time. Today we rid East Anglia of Ruit's clan, once and for all. Remember the dream I spoke of? You sailed through Helheim on a ship of fire. Here, it may come to pass. Dreams. Life. It may be they are one and the same. Tonight I ride the flaming sea steed, rushing for the spear deer. A watcher alight and walks awake. Another glory I will keep. Ready yourselves. Ruined shit stains will see us coming. Limba! Harder yourself! 
Oswald. He lives. Oswald lives! Evil, is that you? Shut your ass, twig spine. Stand fast. This will be over soon. Worry not for me. You must stop. Silence, fool. So this is what it comes to, Wolfkist? Two Danes fighting over a filthy Saxon horse, son? This swine is your prize. Come and get him. Clan, you lead through it. Yes, the one that has bled this country dry for two summers. Flee, Ruit, while pity restrains my blade. Not till I've taken all these shores have to offer. <laughs> It's not yet one, Oswald. East Anglia will have its cake, and it will not be you. You must be blind to stand with such a man. For all your efforts, only the cold dark of Nibelheim awaits you. Valhalla is finished. That fate will not be met today. Why does a Dane fight tooth and nail for a Saxon? Saxon of all. He has an abundance that which you do not. He's fit to rule, fit to lead. You are not a murderous blunderer. This land is rife with weakness, and you are just another blighted dot upon it. Nothing a little fire cannot burn. Danes fighting for a Saxon king. The Sagas. Thank you. You throw in with these wastrels? These Argir swine? For what? A scrap of land and a promise of peace? Eivor, no! He should be tried before God, a lawful assembly. <laughs> I won't have my reign begin with more blood spilt than is needed. Another screeching skull. This man must die for the damage he has wrought. The old laws are clear. These are Oswald's lands, to rule as king as he sees fit. Does Eivor bow to kings? To defy a king would shame him. East Anglia cannot heal without his honor intact. And what of your honor, Eivor? How much are you willing to lose? The rightful king of East Anglia has spared your life today, and so it will be. Compassion is a virtue suited for anyone, Eivor, including you. Thank you. Thank you for heeding me, Eivor. I know the worth of such a gesture. All this is... is like a dream. But you are not asleep. Well fought! Well fought! The both of you! You came as well, old friend. 
If I'd known you were still alive, I would have stayed in Norwich. Look around you. A happy occasion and a glorious victory. And soon, something more grand to take place. A wedding, my love. If you will still have me, that is. And why would I not? I fought poorly. I melted under the heat and anger of that brute. And I never... Oswald, stop. You fought with all your heart and soul. That's all you need ever do. Come then. We have much to prepare for. A bride to wed and a kingdom to lead. But some men wouldn't give for such things. Countless men have died for them. And you, Finir, are you jealous of such things? Hardly. My heart is afire, but my body aches. I desire only a long nap. I saw a bale of hay back there. Later, Abel. For now, I must see to the wounded. Then I will see you at the wedding. Aye, of course you will. I should return to Elmenham. Oswald's wedding will soon begin.